come back in the kitchen again one more time with Chef Ricardo cooking program with the program the program is it's beautiful guys honestly I'm gonna show you something today which is amazing 24 hours ago we marinate that older chicken for it to get roast I didn't do anything but I want to show you how to roast it after you soak your chicken from the day before guys please I'm not gonna show you how to marinate the chicken the recipe is already there I will put the link down below but it's just a different ways I'm showing you how you can marinate your chicken before you put it straight inside of the oven marinate it from the day before and then roast it the next day it tastes beautiful honestly I'm gonna serve it with some vegetable rice some broccoli you're gonna love this one guys you're gonna be amazing anyway remember get a copy of my cooking book is on Amazon at the moment your price your price won't change and thank you so much for your amazing tips and idea we'll be sharing with Chef Ricardo I've been writing underneath this, those video continue to give me the like subscribe to the channel and visit my blog at chefricardocooking.com thank you so much and I'm gonna show you how to roast your chicken in your oven at home enjoy the recipe from Chef Ricardo um, the temperature I'm going to tell you in between at the moment, so stay tuned. So right here I have my chicken and 24 hours ago I marinate the chicken guys. I was going to simply remove the clean flame off the top of it like you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. That's the chicken and the chicken is marinated, soaked. I take it out of the fridge about 5 to 10 minutes ago. Um, basically I'm going to put it in the oven and I'm going to roast it on a medium size heat, gas mark 7. Is good for it if you're using a different kind of oven at 165 or 175 is really good to roast it inside of the oven to 30 35 minutes to 40 minutes inside of the oven and a medium size eat do not preheat your oven first and do not turn up your stove too high put it in the middle of the oven and roast it for 35 minutes if not Give it another five more minutes and I'm going to show you how it look when we finish with it. So guys, enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the channel, leave your comments. And it's amazing to be in the kitchen with you guys, giving your favorite dishes. And this one is from Chef Ricardo. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Nice and lovely. So basically guys, I want to simply say to you, I just take the chicken from the oven and to be honest with you guys, I cook it for roughly said 45 minutes at a medium size eat. As you can see, look at the chicken cook. You can all simply just remove the skin from the chicken. When you want to know your chicken cook really good, look how the bone just simple come up. As you can see, that's all you know your chicken cook really perfect and nice. A lot of people don't know that when you cook your chicken on a medium size, eat it cook perfect, cook the right and proper way, proper and proper temperature. You don't want to cook your chicken and also when you cook your chicken, it don't cook the right and proper way. So I'm just simply saying to you guys, when you're cooking your chicken, cook it on a medium size, eat and it is the best way to cook your chicken so i cook it for roughly four to five minutes inside of the oven and a medium size eat and i'm telling you that's the best way but what i'm gonna do i'm gonna do simple shear up this chicken and i'm um i might just make up like a quick gravy and make you guys can see exactly what i'm talking about oh you can make yourself a nice lovely chicken roast chicken gravy look at this now guys so, nice and lovely so look what we're gonna make a simple little gravy for the roast chicken Basically, I'm going to simply show you what you can do. Pop a teaspoon of vegetable oil inside of this. The pot a little bit warm. Next thing we're going to do is get a medium-sized tomato. And cut it up very small. Straight inside of it like this. One spring onion, that's a spring onion. This is white onion now.
that's the white oil. So I'll take off this one roughly about three to four minutes. Nice and lovely. So basically, as you can see, I just saw it take off the nice one. So nice and lovely. So as you can see, this is finished now. Turn off my stove. The nice one. What we're gonna do? We're gonna simply just pour it over the chicken like this, to just to get the flavor inside of the chicken. Really nice and beautiful. So as you can see, guys, that's what I'm doing at the moment. So I just pour about the same sauce over the chicken, and you can serve it from it. That's the best way. You can do your chicken. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna plate up a nice lovely plate of chicken from this with some vegetable rice. Look how this look now guys, inside of the plate, lovely and nice, look at this. Nice and lovely, as you can see all the chicken looking so fantastic guys. Really lovely. So look at this now, what we're gonna do, we're gonna simple. Cut off a nice piece of the chicken. To serve it. This is what we said juicy. This is just really juicy and nice. Um, basically, just take my little time and get this piece up, guys, because I don't want to be. So if I get this little piece right here, beautiful and nice. Oh man, this is beautiful. This is fantastic. This is some just roast potato and to be honest, this is marvelous i don't know what you're thinking guys but to be honest with you it's a long time i don't do a roast chicken so lovely and nice to be honest nice one so the only reason why i didn't put any veg the rice which i make it got broccoli and carrot and sweet corn inside of it but as you can see looking so lovely and nice and that's the only reason why i didn't put on a veg because there is broccoli and carrot inside of the veg so guys just really lovely and nice enjoy the recipe and subscribe to the youtube channel as you can see the lovely roast chicken and we marinate it over 24 hours so definitely is a lovely recipe so enjoy the recipe and subscribe the youtube channel with the roast chicken thank you so much bye bye and the beauty with it sorry the beauty with it you can also serve it with anything dumpling rice and peas coconut rice vegetable rice you name it so guys enjoy the recipe thank you so much bye bye